Let's finish up fixing these guys then. So there's that one there. Right, right there. Let's see what I can do with the console now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so hit that, then the flame. Oh yeah! Woo! Come on! I can't believe you've done this. So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome back to We Happy Few. The ma- The man? What? The last episode that we did on this game was absolutely insane, okay? Some crazy truths started to come out, and the story is getting insanely thick towards the end. I'm gonna try and break down exactly what happened, okay? So, guys, you better be prepared, because it does get insanely ridiculous. Sally and Arthur's dad, I mean, what the f***? I mean, come on. And then we also made it to the parade district, so, um, yeah. That's pretty cool as well. <laughs> the Parade District is such a unique looking place, man, and I could not wait to hop back in and experience exactly what's going on there because we've only explored like the first 25% of it. And with that said, guys, let's hop straight into this episode. But, uh, you know, firstly, you know, I always go on about taking your joy. So if I go on over here right now, okay, and I end up popping out just over by this door here, okay, to catch the joy from my previous self, okay, and then I'm gonna actually go and head back out of this door for the last time, okay, and then I'm gonna come back from over this side here because then technically I've taken my joy without actually taking my jaw. Sometimes you gotta break the system, okay? However, you guys can't, you know. Like for joy. So anyway, guys, welcome back to We Happy Few. We're straight up in this parade district. Now, one thing just from sitting here and listening to the background music, once it comes around, the place has this kind of somber, I guess, low tone. It feels like the mood has deeply shifted, even though this is supposed to be like the high life, and I'm not really experiencing it right now, you know? Kind of feeling like, yeah, I've been ripped off just a bit. One thing as well I want to show you guys quickly, because in the last episode, I had so many people saying, can you actually drive the cars within this game? And, uh, really? Nope. Do you need me to talk right now? I'm the new guy. Uh, any idea where my desk is? Yeah. Did you hear? Mrs. Sapper found a bomb buried in her garden. Wow. Lucky it didn't blow her up. So, that, that's the name of my desk? Or, I don't care about the stories within this town. Tell me where my desk is. the sun as it tucks me into bed. What the heck is going on? So one more thing as well I think I'm going to do for this episode, guys, is wear my glasses. I haven't done that for the longest time, but if like I'm my face looks... Drugs, what? Am I really happy? I don't think is so. Is there such a thing as false happiness? Uh-huh. But what I'm saying is, is there a true self? I mean, the self you're experiencing right now is technically your true self, because we're not on drugs, we're just kind of doing life as it were. So I guess this is what life is. Like I was saying though, guys, I'm gonna have to wear my glasses for this episode, because like, whilst my face looks normal, this is how my eyes feel inside. We gotta stop that. Ah, much better. Feeling like Arthur as well, you know, that dude. Bruh. So the first thing we have to enter here. Now, I don't know if they're gonna like call me out. dare he cancel on me? What? I don't care if he's double booked. He was nothing before I taught him how to walk. Wow. Uh, I know. I I know how to model. Sorry, okay. love. It's ruin the drain. <gasps> Buy me a new male model. Too sweet. Wow. This dude. We got replay that, by the way. Wow. That was fast. Hmm. Right height. Right build. Bit tan for my taste. Okay. You're new, aren't you? Never mind. If Quentin sent, you're probably not hopeless. Bro. I just hope to God you can strut. Is this really how you Go get a modeling? Go downstairs and ask Nigel what to do. You know? I'm gonna have to do this stupid fashion show to get it, aren't I? Um, Maybe the models can tell me how not to make a complete fool of myself up there. Keep your foot still whilst I think to myself, okay? If I'm now the fashion model, I'll be taking that scotch firstly. So, Chris McKenzie. Cool groove, day. Is it? you just love the smell of motoline? It's uh, so modern. Yeah, okay. Can we just honestly think for a second, guys? I've only just walked in this place. I might have just wanted to buy a jacket, but I've just got myself a modeling job in the highest district. This is going to be paying pretty damn good. So, uh, what's this? Photo studio? Okay, that's the basement there. What the freak? This is crazy. Compliment machine? Uh, let's, uh, I guess try it. I don't make them like you anymore. Is that good or bad? Is that actually a compliment, honestly? Try one more. When they made you, they broke the mold. <laughs> Uh, I don't really understand. Is this a compliment? Try one more, okay? You have such a wonderful sense of humor. There you go, that's better. All right, I think the only thing we can really do here is go ahead and enter the photo studio, aka my crib. Because that's all I'm treating this place as. Dang, place looking pretty good. Hey, how's it going, Celia? You, yep. and the door. you seem what? not entirely delighted. I waved at you. Stage bright. The last time I tripped on the catwalk, Davy locked me in a f closet for three days. <laughs> Big oof. I could use a shot of whiskey. But I've all got... we have in this wretched place of drugs. Bro, I got the whiskey. Take the freaking whiskey. There you go. That's gonna make you feel a bit better. All right. Thank Drink God. it though. All right. Can you believe he made me tape up my shoes? Like that girl who played Dorothy in that old movie about the shoes. Wow. And there she is, down in the scotch. Bro, this place is rough. That helps. I'll let you in on a little modeling secret. Okay. I toss the crowd a bouquet. 
right? They love that. All those lads want to be brides, but it's not going to happen, is it? I don't know. I guess not. Uh, thanks, Celia. Appreciate that. Got some sewing kits right here. It's past curfew. It's irrelevant. I'm already well and truly in this place here. I could take uh, a few more of these next and I wouldn't be a downer anymore. I sure. like these wastrels. I could just take my joy and have done. Nah, dude. Give me that Nexamide pill. What the freak is a Nexamide pill anyway? VIP's lounge is for VIP's. All right, I'm going to see about that one. From Dave Hackney. Are your pub mates beautiful? Are they famous? No? Well then, bloody stop letting them into the VIP lounge. The whole point of the VIP lounge is to keep people out. That's what makes people want to be in it. If you let any plug from the village, we might as well call it the Prole Hovel. Kind of remember this if you wish to remain employed. Take the fab threads as well. What's wrong with all this stuff? I mean, I got to take it. something away before something starts chasing you. All right, keep okay, robbing you. Fart. What? My pants ripped. <gasps> Davey will kill me. Stop fighting them, then, bro. You wouldn't have a sewing kit. I've got three, in fact. What? This is, like, so easy. Robin, come back. Where the freak's he going? I'm trying to give you the... What? Is Let's try that you? one more time. There you go. And that's it, I guess? Thanks, Azil. No problem. Now the whole crowd won't have to see my knickers. I'm sort of... Why are you wearing knickers for? New. Got any advice? This place try is cool. this. Is I'm watching you move. Right, so a load of co Okay, what, just like that. Alright, let's give this a go. So camera there. So what's gonna happen is- Ah! Ah! Okay, I'm gonna go there. Ah! Ah! Okay, so we're next to my pill. Vomiting from food poisoning, this basically eliminates that or counteracts it. If we're really desperate to eat some food, that's exactly what we can do and then take one of those. Alright, definitely worth knowing. But the VIP lounge, I mean, there's only one guy in it, and that's probably Dave right there. Wigs and makeup. He needs the photo room key. Alright, I got the key for the VIP lounge. I think so. Go ahead, press that. Let's go on in. How's it going? That's Hugo. Uh, Hugo, where you go? <laughs> you look like a ghost. Sorry. You are the one, aren't you? I'm a bit f***ed up, but Candyman said it was a Sally special, but... But he lied. This place is crazy. I'd kill several innocent people for a flash. What? Do you know any innocent people? I don't either. This is like the worst district to ever be in. Give him the f I guess I've got one? You're a lifesaver. What the heck? And he's just gonna pop it like that? Uh, any advice? Guess we better learn. Catwalk. Do a cheeky little bang bang gesture. <laughs> they love that. The bang bang gesture. Why is it with people popping out of existence? I am crazy. Now, what else do we have in here? More scotch. I may as well take that one. A load of Nexamide and Joy. Nexamide are more important than the Joy. I've got like 20, I think, uh, Joy ones so far. Uh, other than that, this room is kind of trash. Like, wow. I'm glad I'm not a VIP. Now, it gives me the option to give her another ball of the scotch. Let me see what happens if I give her maybe two. Just give me the key. Okay, that dude just came out. He's opened it. Who is that? Okay, whoever it was was actually irrelevant. Can you not close doors in people's faces, you rude mother- Just a load of mannequins. We got wigs galore back here. All striking a pose. Uh, the furnace room. Let's go ahead and check this out. Hey, so this is where we can use our stuff. Now, if you remember, we did actually take the upgrade for this and uh, the no questions axe. I've got an axe, okay? But more importantly, let's do this, man. Woo! Another upgrade for the workbench. Give me that good stuff. So let's see now what we can do with this thing. Let me see what other, uh, I guess, weapons we can maybe craft. Ah, now I can start making the good weapons. So the no questions axe. Wounds and cauterizes at the same time. All right, so uh, good if you chop a limb off and don't want to bleed everywhere. Not really sure who wants that. Also, the jolliest brolly, okay? This is something I got when I first purchased the game. It's like a collector's item. I always wanted to make it, and it was this jubilator activator that I needed from the get-go. And so we're going to craft that thing straight away. And we have ourselves the jolliest brolly. Let's go. Hold on, let me equip this thing a second to so use the weapon. Ooh, it's like a jabby with an electric point on the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like I'm back in dying light. You know, these weapons look ridiculously brutal, okay? I'm nice and kitted out for this zone. But the sandwich blueprint as well for the, uh, I guess, the chemistry place and the pipe down. Chemistry upgrade, though. I've not got any of those. I'm not sure if I'm missing them or if uh, maybe they just haven't appeared yet. Now, we're not quite done here. We've got this little crawl space. That is the creepiest looking thing I've ever seen. What have I just stumbled upon? Okay, search the crate. So I need to go ahead and force this thing open. Uh, what is that? 25 sovereign, a breaker, canteen, and coffee beans. I guess I'll take it all. What's with the doll here, though? That is really, really creepy. Just a random crack mirror. So I guess one of the people using it is like a uh, secret storage space. Question is why? Let me see what chemicals I can craft here. Chemistry. The thermal syringe and antiseptic. 
Don't really need either of those. More just the healing bam. And I've got loads of Gillian, thank goodness. I've also got a load of skill points, 20 to be exact. What else should we upgrade? I've kind of neglected combat. Just focus so much on stealth. First thing then I'm going to get is Iron Fist, because that then would lead straight on over to the second one here. The pack a wallop. Do more damage by hitting people, and that is with a weapon. Night Stalker. Reduce visibility at night. Again, a key one that we need, because nighttime is a pain in the butt to get through. And then that will lead on to this last one, nothing to see here, where you're basically immune at nighttime. All right, well, we got popping back here then. Uh, ooh, track access hash, let's go. There's nowhere to sleep down here though. I'm ready for my next visit back here. Sure, but like, where's my bed? I wanna sleep. Let's just make our way through. Aye. So we've got hair, oh, I thought his name was actually Hairbo. Wait, that's a mannequin. <laughs> Davey, darling, you wanted to know why I seem off today, but you already know why, even if you think you don't. Deirdre returned a hair bow to me that she had found by the bed. She thought it was mine, though I never wear chatra shirt. You've been in our bed with Pris, haven't you? No one else can pull off chatra How could you? I decorated that bed to think you and Pris on my parachute silk sheets. How could I ever trust you again? I am doubling up my joy today, but don't assume that the smiles mean that you haven't broken my heart. So here's our bed, and people got nice and busy on it, but look, I'll sleep on it. It looks comfy. Ah, Sorry, there you go. Trying to... Yeah, after that last flashback, probably the best thing not to do. There was some deep stuff going on there, man. What's this dude doing? Get the freak out of my bedroom, Robin, you freak it. I just sleep in my bed. What the freak? Now you got Hugo. I'm never sleeping in that bed again. The crowd's restless, dearie. Go out there and fucking wow them. Not really in the mood just right now. Just to the spots marked with X and okay. show yourself off. And quickly. Freak. Guys, we'll get going then. Oh my gosh! You're capable of walking ten feet, aren't you? Are you? That oh, with a foot up your backside? You do, don't f up. All right. Okay, wow. On your mark and work it. Why do I have this? No choice right now. Be fierce. What? This? Oh. Oh boy. Okay, let's pose. I'm the fiercest. Yeah. Right, I'm doing the bong bong. Wait, I'm watching you. Let's go. Run sexy enough. We're actually doing that thing, man. What the heck? Okay, keep going round. Okay, throw a bouquet or pose. Uh, let's How do that one. People. There you go. Uh, all right. Yeah, we're done here. Did we do good, Davey? Hopeless. You're utterly sung charisma. I'm not surprised you're homeless. Say, Mr. Hackney. Wow. It's a bit late, and I sort of live on the other side of town. Would it be too much trouble to bunk? I suppose you did do me a favor. Here, get some beauty sleep. Not that it'll help. I mean, I've already made my acquaintance down there. You've received the photo room key. <laughs> I already got it. This game is just fire, man. Like, you do all this stuff and you never expect it to transition into, I guess, anything like that. But it always turns out being so much more unique. Anyway, we've got to get back to the quest at hand, Future Perfect. This was, I think, getting into the scientific lab and uh, whatever the weird Dr. Nigel Thornberry was talking about with a girl. We need that tool, pronto. So this was the zone we last made it to just before we cut the episode. And uh, there's Nigel Thornberry right there. And this dude, I don't know why they just stroll around so happy. What are you even doing? You're about to get, like, stung by bees and stuff. So we are heading over then to Ark Right, that's gonna be, I guess, our solution. We can see different things: the parade, the gravel walk, and the king's Food didn't meat. used to go wrong okay. this fast. I mean, if Did you're he? carrying it and your body's warm, can I set that stuff off? House of the Future. Visit 1984. Wow, that's cool because you forget that this is like just post World War II. Okay, more of those Gileads, thank you very much. Uh, let's check around the side of this, though. I'm gonna pick all the berries as well, and no one can stop me. All right, so we need to now get inside of this building, picked enough of the plants. Uh, yeah, that ain't opening. There's a big old spiral staircase, so hop over this. Let's go on up. I I'm in the I thought I'd glitch. I was gonna be mad right there. But it's alright though. This music they're cheering us on. Let's go on up. See exactly. Says, oh man. Yeah, you're already dead. We've read about you already. Uh, fashion of the future. When we're on the moon, maybe? What are these manned peeper things? What? Play music and make phone calls. They haven't even got to this stage yet. You say it, this types it. Wow, I see all this future stuff. And there's a jubilator. Hey, let's go. Absolutely no one at the reception here. Works only beyond this point. Uh, Swift Laboratories. I'm going to have to enter, though. No one to approve me, I guess. So let's get this done. Let a machine clean your house. Maybe not of that scale. Probably like a shortened one. Swift Laboratories. There's two different ways in. Now, if I were to me disable the quarantine gates, where would I be? If it's not down here, pocket, man. I bet it's in that office. All right. Why does this place feel so weird? We what? need to adjust the flow mechanism. It's still oh. wasting a lot of motor leave. So this is what goes on behind the scenes, huh? Open this door. So we're trespassing straight away. Why do I feel like I'm about to find a UFO? I don't know. It reminds me of, like Thunderbirds. Like you guys getting that? Nope. Just me? Okay. Control room. What was that? He ducked straight away. Uh, what was that right there? That's a power cell. It looks empty. Let me go ahead and see what's in the desk too. See what sort of stuff these guys are rocking up 
in the director's office, okay? And let's see. Scotch in an empty bottle. What the freak is with these crappy people and the crappy loot and the crappy- Do not point the cannon at my window when I'm not looking. All right, uh, the heck is this crap? So the hot flash button? Look, I'm not gonna pull that if I don't know what I'm doing. Do we got a note anywhere around here? Let me open this door. What the freak is going on? This leads on to another office. Get on the low. There's no one here. Okay, I'm going back to the control panel. If I press a button, surely it's gonna do something good. Said every person that presses the red button ever. All right, hold on. Pull the lever. Not so, working. I better go downstairs and see what's wrong with it. Trying to figure out exactly what this is gonna do. So it mentions not pointing the cannon at his window and that might be it there, but I'm not sure. This is probably gonna rotate stuff though. All right, let me just first off check what's going on along this walkway here, but we gotta dip down there kind of soonish. Okay, what's this? So the Swift Lads research. Do not disturb under any circumstance, I'm thinking. And if any doctors come looking for me at Framistat, send them to me. Locked, of course. Yep. Can't have the staff running in and out asking questions, can we? So important I'm to just simply a think. Very difficult equation. Leave me in peace. Do you hear us talking? Apparently Confucius was wrong. The uh -huh. way in is not by the door. Right. So make another way in. Here. What? I can't be down on the floor all the time chasing people. This place. It's bizarre. And I love it! Anyway, we're gonna make ourselves another way through. So, you know what? Let's do this nice and safe. We go around this side here. And we should be able to dip down. I think, anyway. Alright. What is that? So, we're gonna get to- What?! Are you kidding me? We're gonna enter through the cannon? Hold up. Okay, I'm gonna hold fire for just a second. Uh, this is the cannon, okay? <laughs> I was out. I'm gonna take that one. This is like the lounge area. I can hear a big old leak somewhere. Can't see it immediately. Hmm. I see someone's in the car. Me? You don't have any you oh boy, should we take him down? Uh, yeah. Oh. Have to put this guy to sleep. Sorry, He's Hillary Carey. It. it had to be done. Okay, we'll put you down here. Gently does it. And yeah, that wasn't gentle. All right, let's keep going through. So the dude wanted himself a tea. Look, if I go through this way, then here he may think that I guess we're that person. It's jammed. What? I right, place that in there, I guess. Maybe we've got to make some coffee or something like that. Let's go ahead and do that. So we'll buy it and we'll pick it up. Now, wait, do we just go to the office? Like, have we done it? Bro, there's a freaking guy here. Oh, yeah? You wanna fight here? Yeah! this to each other. How do I get up in there? In the cannon? The glass looks fairly solid. I need a gun to break it. What are you talking or about? What cannon? Guns? There does seem to be a rather Thinking large about. cannon here. Oh, yeah. I'd have to rotate it, but it is on a circular platform. Up there. So we get that. Or so. Bro, probably dead. Thanks to your experiments. We're gonna go under here. I think I can elevator back up, I guess. I don't know. What? I just took the elevator back out. What the hell? When you think you're being sneaky, but in fact, you just basically messed up the whole mission. Yeah, that's me right now. We'll use this opportunity to go the other side. Uh, I think literally it's just gonna be the door. Yeah. So, what he asked that, no one responded, so he's dead. Okay, don't go through that door there. Uh, I don't know how I'm gonna successfully get around all these people. Like, I'm gonna be seen, surely, as I stay on the low. See, they all look very, very occupied. Okay, we get over toward this, though, here. This is gonna be the jackpot. Now, don't look at me, don't look at me. Okay, this is the shower unit. So inside we go. Who are you? Oh, God, okay. Oh, boy. Okay, we, we gotta do it, guys. I have no choice. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Look, he's just sleeping right now. Uh, he needs a shower. Uh, go in there. All right, I'll take the valve handle, but legit, guys, I had no choice. Like, I had to do it, okay? But that valve handle, now, what are we going to use that for? Surely something of importance nearby? It's just a case now of trying to find a way to get past all these guys. There's, like, one facing every single direction. This might be a bit tricky. Hold up a sec. I've got myself a boiler suit. If I change into that, and I don't get it equipped, great. Stay on the low behind these things here. Okay, he sees me. Look, now he doesn't. Uh, I kind of feel like I need don't this. Let me, me sit. I'm Just have a bit of a sit down. So what can I do here? Uh, All right, yeah. This is awkward. All right, guys, I've been caught. I'm just going to look at these quickly. Okay, denied in combat. I'm just going to obliterate every single one of their faces. I'm done. Okay, now back to inspecting the machines. This one here. An electrowave stimulator. What does it do? Well, I guess. suppose it stimulates electrowaves. That doesn't sound right. Hmm. Seems to be missing a battery. So what, a power cell? I mean, I got one. No, I can't place it in there. So within the different, I guess, uh, areas, there's going to be uh, things we've got to pick up. Oh, I'm doing this. Guy. I can't be bothered to deal with these people. Sit down! What is this thing? This seems to turn modeling crystals into like gas. A lot of gas would charge up that cannon. Mm -hmm. I'll probably need some sort of 
valve handle to unblock this, I think. What have I got right now, Arthur? Come on, use a brain, which you probably don't have in your head. And the final machine right here. It's a prototype for some sort of torture use in the kitchen? Doesn't that? seem to have all its bits. I wonder if I could find something around here. So a couple of elements we got to search. Let's get to find it, I guess. Oh no, wait, we've got this machine here. What is that? The, the moisturizer? It seems to be in operating Ugh. condition. These machines That's don't good. seem to be in tip-top condition, do they? Okay, so replace the missing part there. Okay, so we need a spare nozzle and a fancy battery, and that's it. All right, probably going to be something in here. Okay, my man sees me. Uh, my man also sees my weapon in my hand, connected with his face. The electro-wave battery, so I'll be taking that one. All right, good stuff. And the final thing then should be over here, the hot flash nozzle. This could be useful. It's the two that we need. Yep, and that will just about do it. Right, my man's seen the dead bodies. Now look, okay, join them in this way, okay? Ooh, you bastard! Let's finish up fixing these guys then. So, there's that one there. Now, the electro-wave stimulator. All right. Right there. Let's see what I can do with the console now. Mm-hmm. So, I think we need to rotate it. Still going on about hugs. He's dead. He died a long time ago, thanks to you, Doc. All right then. So, pull the lever. Hey. Oh, crap. I didn't mean that. So, we gotta, I guess, turn these things on. The freak is going on. Okay, I think I get it. So, if I pull the lever... I don't know what I'm doing. Hold up. Rotate 90 degrees. Aha! So, one more should do it. I think we gotta get it facing that way. Just like so. And then, if, if I push this button here, will it swap the places? That is dope, man. That is so cool. So, my guess is we gotta get this cannon over to this point here, and that's probably it. Okay, so, this guy can come this way here. Look at the bodies! <laughs> kind of morbid, but I don't care. And this one, we move that way just a bit more here. And then, one more just this way here. Now, that looks nicely aligned, if you ask me. Let's see. So, that's going straight up there. Oh, very Got it. Wow. Right oh, Maybe? Okay, I don't know why I keep doing that. I gotta stop. Okay, it says align the machines to blast a new door. Uh, what do you mean? Am I using all three of these or something? Okay, so over to this thing here. Can I not load this thing? I... Okay, I think that's in the right spot, but we need these other tools to do something. I think more specifically this one here, maybe? Okay, let me move some of this stuff around a little bit here. I don't understand entirely what I'm trying to do. If I rotate this, I gotta get that facing that way there. Ugh, can these guys not? Wait, if these things are all facing the same way, uh, let me hit this. Okay, it's doing I something. Need more than a I need a bloody great blast of it. Got it. So I kick this up a notch. I got you. Get that thing out of the way. We need, I guess, that guy there. Oh man. This dude has no idea what's happening behind closed doors. <sighs> like that? And that's what we're doing! It. Okay, so hit that, then the flame. Ooh! Oh yeah! Woo! Come on! Holy crap! I think the dock is dead! I can't talk him. Get the framistat. We killed him! Alright, let's climb over here. Oh my goodness. That felt almost too good to do, okay? So we're in. Where the freak is the dock? Was he in here? I don't know. Can you press the button? How is this man so emotionless, right? We've just blown a hole straight in the side of his lab. Yo, doc, all of your experiments, yeah, they're all exposed. So uh, what are you going to say about that? Let's find out. I suppose you're who I have to thank for the hole in my wall. Oh, you're welcome. Knock. I Don't guess. be silly. Do you know how long I've been asking them to fix the hot flash? What? I can't even remember. He... Oh, uh, the power cell was missing. Oh, oh for heaven's sake. They said they had to wait for a part. Mm. Look, without help or even a manual, you fixed three machines. Is he really thanking us for this right now? Reaction. Yes. Wow. Well, sorry about that. I think I we're about to get an award right we now. We can figure things out. Are you actually... Would you like a job? Uh, oh, uh, I'm afraid I'm sort of trying to get out of town. Yeah. Why? This is the best of all possible worlds. Nothing gets done, but everyone's happy. Uh, the second part, I can not agree with, man. sort of exasperated, uh. actually. Well, don't tell anyone, all right? So he's How not... are you getting past the quarantine gates without a framistat? Well, that's why we're here, man. to get one from, uh, here. Is They've been pestering me for a while. Tell you what, I'll give you one, and when you're done with it, Give it to them from me. Wow. That's very kind of you, I will. Are you kidding me? Here, I'm look around. If there's something else you can use, take it. Are you actually out of your mind, Richard Arkwright? I've destroyed your lab. I, I, I just busted up a big hole in your window. And the man thanks me. All right, I'm out of here, man. This was ridiculous. 
I can't believe I got thanked for destroying someone's place and killing like 20,000 of his workers. Bizarre. Just bizarre. Uh, okay. Where's the exit? I thought I was going out. The freak have I just found here? Ooh. My goodness. The good stuff. Thank you very much, Doc. Looking around this room, I think this was pretty much an optional thing then to come back up here. Looks like it's the upper floor. Maybe where the Doc chills afterwards. But that's, I think, about it with this zone. You know, I think we're all done here. Uh, now, on a serious note, I have really, really messed this place up, okay? About 12 people are literally dead on this Doc's hands. And the blood is on his hands, not mine. Exit here. Let's go. Goodness. I'm out of this place. Not bad though, you know. When in trying to break in, he ends up thanking me for doing everything that I did. Strange twist of fate. That's all I'm saying. Now before we do anything else, okay, the malpractice of doctors, I ain't gonna focus on that. There is even more areas to this place and I wanna check them out. Look at that monument. A bulldog biting down on the neck of some bird? The heck is the significance there? Look at this thing. That's beautiful, man. Crazy stuff going on here. The Wellington Wells Broadcasting is that where we came from? Let me go near it. So nothing to see. It's locked off. Wait, wait, wait. This constable's Sorry, gonna sir. know something. Quarantine. No one can go through. So I can see. I sort of need to get into the building. Oh, I don't doubt it for a minute. But whilst I have the responsibility, I do not have the authority, if you grasp my predicament. Okay. It's those doctors at the Wellington Health. They've locked right. down the whole bloody district. Well, I suppose I should just go visit the Wellington Health then? I guess well, so. If you can go talk some sense to them, you'd be the hero of the parade, I imagine, sir. Everybody knows the plague's not real. Do they now? But I also I've suspect that the only Rosetti. way to live this stupid quarantine is somewhere in the Wellington Health Building. Of course it would be. So that's, I guess, going back there to enter the broadcast tower when we can. Gotta do the other quest just first, though. But that's pretty cool. I was all linking back in one big old circle. And uh, yeah, don't mind me picking the plants, okay? Now, how about this way here? What is this strange archway just here? House call? Find an alternate route to the Wellington Health Institute. Is this like a separate oh zone? I've forgotten about the headmistresses. Okay. Whoa, there is so much more going on here too. A lot of danger. Okay then guys, so rather than dabbling in the side quest right here, which I don't want to just yet, what I'm going to do is go straight back and focus on the butcher quest I mentioned in the last episode. That thing captivated me, and I guess it's not within this zone, so we're going to go back to the other district. I think it was... That's hey. my old office. What? I bet Clive got my window, didn't he? Oh, this the little which, which one? Hold on, this one here? Department of Archives Printing. That's it. Wow, man. The whole world joining back up. From our window, we could actually see a double-decker bus. So was it maybe around this side here? I don't see no bus. The freak? Uh, yeah, Arthur, I think you're delusional. All right, so I've got a really weird problem. The door itself won't open back up, so I don't know what to do. I'm starting to think that maybe if we go over by where the house call part is, Maybe we can find a track access hatch, like there definitely was one, you know, we broke out there. So I, I guess we're going to try that. But it would be a shame if we can't go back and now finish off the other quest I wanted to do, because, yeah, that sucks. Yeah, look, they're all locked off. Constable Grimshaw, your face looking like a piece of- Oh, man. I don't think I'm going to be able to get around this one right here. At no point do we get a break. It's going to see that we're not on our joy. Oh, boy. Wait, wait, wait. I've got the things, like the syringes, I think it was. I can dip the way. I could disable it. There was a pill, though, that Sally gave us, am I right? It gives the illusion of being on joy without actually being on it. The sunshine pill, okay? It mimics outward symptoms of joy for a short time. If we pop that thing, okay? We're gonna look right now that we're on joy, you see? We can stroll like it, and it doesn't care. A great solution right there. There must be some now way to put here. it to bed for a bit. Otherwise, how do they get close to weather maintenance and such? What? What are you talking about? So locate the Maltoline pump room? Yeah, we're gonna focus, guys, on this house call thing then. Again, it sucks. I really wish I could do the other one, but... We need to do something here. I'll take that. You saw nothing. All right. Okay. These pipes trailing into this thing here. So we got to disable this whole thing, I guess. I don't see how they expect see. me to visit the shops on the other side with all these bankers and things. Exactly. I almost feel unwanted. Do I do this here? Okay, look. I want to go ahead and do it. I don't really know what else to do. So uh, we'll do that. That's that shut down. Did it open the door, though? I don't think so. Wait, what? I'm off it. Gotta be careful of that. Very, very mindful. Please step away ah! ah! Go. That was close. All right, I think I gotta go in this place here. Uh, yeah, sort your peepers out, man. Okay, so I need a key card, but look, I'm gonna go ahead and hack it. Found one of these tools lying around. Make that good use of. Good stuff. Uh, I wonder if she's powered from right. here. So we're gonna uh, get rid of this thing. So reverse polarity? What is, wait, what is that thing? I'm gonna use it anyway. I don't even know what it is. Okay. 
but this will just... What the freak did I do then? So confused trap will zap your enemies for a little while? W will it kill me? Hold up! I'm good, okay. I mean, it doesn't say I'm trespassing and that Bob is getting himself a coffee. So I can head in here, got the best workbench. First aid kit, bit late for that. And the berserk dart as well. Press the button, all right. So I shut that down. So... Oh, what a cat. <sighs> Now headmistress can't scold me for breaking quarantine. I guess. Uh, do I need to get in there or not? I'm not sure. Oi, okay, I'll get his attention. Get if I run through here, it should confuse him, right? Are you coming? I'll Bro, I'm here. Right. Let's see what happens. Okay, be on the ready with a weapon. Oh, oh! It's gonna do it! And it missed. That's already... What the freak? Am I about... I was... Whoa, whoa, whoa! He's a powerful puppet. I gotta take him down. Let's go. Come on! My health is the lowest it's ever been, I think. Goodness. Just lie down. Yeah. Thank goodness for that. That was too close. The not just cricket bat. Okay, I'll take that one. Thank you very much. Uh, duct tape and stuff like that. Uh, room seems kind of pointless though, you know? All right, let me see. Door still locked up. What the freak am I doing here? You know, I'm so confused. The alarms are going off for that thing, but everything else is still in working order. All right, pop another one of those sunshine pills. Uh, let me check this out then. So the alarm is beeping there. Can I turn anything off here? You know, I don't think I can. Wait, right there, button. House call. So raise the shutter, escape the quarantine area. This is it. I don't know. Yeah, going in there will be trespassing. Wait for Grimshaw to go past. Okay, now we had an in. Now all we gotta do is get through here, and I guess we're good. We actually, hold up. I can just dip through here. Tap water. We rarely find that stuff. And a short spike, all the good stuff, and through we go. So this is in quarantine, this place right now. This is house call. Let's check it. It's our way out. Ah, got ya! All right, I think this is our way back here. This is sketchy as heck, man, but the rocks are kind of laid out in such a way. Hop down, easy does it. All right, one more here. Let's go. This is our ticket, yeah. We're supposed to be able to get back down here. Wait, hold up, if I jump here, okay, there's like an invisible barrier. This is so annoying, man. Wait, I can't go back? What? This is stupid, are you kidding me? I mean, I can jump that way, that's like it. If I mess with this thing, can I get access to that thing? I'll jab it in. Uh, Bruh. Okay, what the heck is going on? This game is getting really annoying. Then I'm just back here, and the doors won't open. What? Oh, Alright, I'm really confused. I'm actually slightly annoyed. So I can't do any more side quests at all? Nope. What? Okay then guys, well for this one, I guess I'm gonna have no choice but to leave it here. That is very frustrating though, how you know the rocks allow you to scale back down, but when you get to this point, you can't explore back on yourself. I can't find the one access track hatch thing that I've got, so it was like a one trip deal thing. Like, I don't know, I feel a bit weird about that. We're gonna stay positive though, because I do have a backup save where I guess if need be, I can go back and do the mission from there, but we've made it. And this is basically like the final quest. I think there's one more after this one, and then we're basically all wrapped up with this game, or at least Arthur's plot. So crazy stuff, the next episode may just be the ending. For this episode though, we kind of acquainted ourselves a bit more with the parade district and what's really popping off here. Some interesting things, and it's really not what it's all brought up to be, but uh, I guess we'll find out the last of the stuff in the next episode. And I guess for this episode, guys, we're gonna leave it here, and I hope you did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like rating? and hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here. So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one.